بما أن تركيا تحشد القوات على الحدود مع الشمال السوري ضد الأكراد السوريين بريت ماكوغوريك المبعوث الرئيسي الرئاسي الأمريكي الخاص ضد داعش يقول لتركيا أنه لا يريد أن يحدث أي شيء من شأنه أن يعرقل حملة الرقة I have a question about Turkey. Turkey is massing along the border, the northern side. Uh, some of the Kurds that we're talking to, they're saying, like, if the Turks attack us, we're going to have to leave Raqqa and go back to defend our areas. Is the, is the, Turkish, uh, are the, is the Turkish presence along the border hindering your Raqqa operation? And what kind of message do you have to, for the Turks? So, no, right now, everything in the Raqqa campaign, again, is according to uh, the plan that we laid out. Again, it's very difficult. It's going to take time, but uh, laying out according to plan. And we continue to consult with the Turks uh, weekly in terms of exactly uh, what's happening and, and keeping them up to date because obviously they have a great interest in what happens, uh, particularly in the post raqqa phase. And one reason it's great to be here to talk to the Raqqa Civilian Council is about what happens after ISIS in Raqqa and to make sure that local people from Raqqa are in charge of their own affairs and set the conditions for people to return to their homes. That's really fundamental in the post-ISIS phase. So we're not there yet. We won't be there for some time, uh, but we're in close consultations with Turkey on that. Uh, and obviously in terms of Turkey's own military operations, something we talked to them about uh, uh, quite a bit, and we'll continue to consult with them. But obviously, we would not want anything to happen that would disrupt the Raqqa campaign, because the Raqqa campaign is critical and essential uh, to protecting all of us. Uh, that is where so many attacks have been planned around the world, including attacks in Turkey. So that's why Raqqa is so important, and uh, you know, so far, we feel pretty good about it, but it'll take some time.